What's going on, Nerd Army guys? It is time for another reaction. So guys, this is going to be my reaction to DC's Legends of Tomorrow One Chance promo. Now, this was suggested to me by a few different subscribers. Um, I just hadn't had a chance to get to it. I had a bunch of other videos planned already. So, let's get into this one, guys. I'm excited. I'm really stoked for this show. Um, so, let's get into it. So, here we go. I specifically oh, shit. Oh, <laughs> Oh, it's dope. We Oh! Doesn't a legend have to be dead? That's a deal breaker for me. <laughs> I chose you, I travel throughout time. <laughs> because the future of the world is in peril. I am the worst nightmare. Oh, man. I say we kick some ass. That was awesome. Oh, shit! DC's Legends of Tomorrow series premiere Thursday, so January awesome. 21st on the CW. We go out for one lousy drink and you guys somehow managed to pick a fight with Boba Fett. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, yeah, shit. I knew it had to be Captain Cold that had to give that one good one-liner. That was awesome, guys. So a couple things I noticed in that. Um, like Rip Hunter is going to be a big part of the show, which we already knew. But I'm... I'm excited for it because if you guys don't know, Rip Hunter is actually the son of Booster Gold. Yes, Booster Gold, that douchebag time traveling fucking superhero that just is a superhero because of all of his tech. Um, yeah, think of him as like a douchebag time traveling Iron Man. Um, so Booster Gold's actually a cool character. I really enjoy Booster Gold, but his son is Rip Hunter, but it's his son very far in the distant future from the booster goal we know in the comics. So, um, I just like the fact that it's his son. Uh, we're getting some form of booster gold on TV, even though they're not going to, they're going to save booster gold and blue beetle for big screen. Damn it. But, uh, booster gold exists. That's his sperm at work right there. Um, so the, another cool thing I really liked is Jay Jackson's character. Um, as the other half of Firestorm sitting there, uh, Martin decides, like, yeah, to be a legend, doesn't it, uh, don't you have to die? He's like, that, that's a deal breaker for me. That shit was great. Um, there were some really good one-liners in this. I, re I really thought it was fucking awesome. Um, and uh, I can't wait to get into the time travel aspect of the DC TV universe, like, more. <coughs> Like, more than we've got. Like, the Flash, we got the time travel that way. But with Rip Hunter and the Time Masters, it's a totally different, totally different freaking level of time travel. This is going to be awesome. Um, I can't wait to see how they're going to combat Vandal Savage and what caused him to come back in time to get people to make a team in the first place. I really want to see that, too. Um so, guys, let me know what you guys thought about that trailer and my reaction to that trailer and my thoughts on it. Let me know down in the comments down below, guys. Did you like that trailer? And are you excited for Rip Hunter and DC's Legends of Tomorrow? Let me know down in the comments down below, guys. And thank you very much for tuning in. If you like this video, make sure to rate it with that big thumbs up. And, guys, I will see you next time right here on Nerds Memorized for another reaction. Peace out. If you liked the video you just saw, make sure you rate it with that big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe so you can check out all the other nerdy videos we have just like this one. Also, check out my Patreon account and become a patron if you like for access to exclusive content.